So we've seen two of the waiters now. Are you ready for the main course? Sorry? Are you ready for the main course? I want at the same time. No, I mean, are you ready to order the main course? We've ordered already. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Ordered. Sorry. No, yeah, we're good. Sometimes we get overwhelmed and we just like to help each other. Yeah. Um, but of course, obviously here, lack of communication. Yeah, but if somebody's yeah, in yeah. a rush, that gets set across the board to everybody, doesn't it? In Definitely. terms of... Ah! The pastilla. Pastilla. Here. I don't think it looks wildly appetising. It looks a little bit dry. The wood pigeon's been minced to such a degree you can't really distinguish it from any other meat. In my opinion, I think mincing up the wood pigeon is an, is an error. They didn't, they didn't mince out that little piece of wood pigeon. Shouldn't leave bones in it. Annoying. It's also bloody dangerous. Bone? Yeah, it's one of the things where... Clumsy? Yeah, it, but to, to, be, to be honest with you, it does happen ever so often, but it, it's just yeah. care and attention. Could I have a little side order of tabbouleh? Tabbouleh? Yeah, just a little, a little bit of tabbouleh. Uh, it was almost as if he was too busy to, to deal with us. Oh, no, I wanted... Oh. I've got some of that. Is that some of No, I, want, I wanted a little bowl of tabbouleh. Tabu tabbouleh? Yeah. yeah okay. But it is a bit perplexing. We've had two occasions now where they've been a mistake because they're not communicating with each other. Excuse me. I ordered some tabbouleh. I wanted to know it was coming. To be, to be honest with you, I'm now confused about what I've told which waiter. Ah, it's my tabbouleh. Yes. Thank you. So the tabbouleh's arrived, but it was a good ten minutes and I had to ask two different waiters and it got delivered by a third. Fragmented service as opposed to two waiters looking after that. They've been interrupted four or five times with five different waiters. It's a busy restaurant and, you know, you've got to... Nobody's took control. It's no excuse. They haven't filled our water up since we arrived. I'm just going to leave that there. It's in a very prominent position. We'll just see if they fill it up. Can I have a little more water? It's over an hour since I had any water, and now I've asked for some and it still hasn't come. Excuse me? Can I have some water? Ah, the water. I mean, just because it's a Moroccan restaurant doesn't mean we have the water retention ability of a camel. <laughs> That's sadly. Oh. We've been waiting an hour for water. They shouldn't be waiting that long for water. Definitely not. I mean, for me, to watch that, it's very, you know, um, yeah, disappointing. He's met so many waiters, and none of them noticed that the, the, the water glass, they were empty. But you are somewhat overstaffed with bodies there. When you've had the eighth, the ninth, the tenth waiter hit the table, you feel a bit sort of, Jesus, you know, I'm just, you know, on a conveyor belt here and just being passed along to the next person. There's a restaurant that can transport you to another place. You can eat good food, perfectly good food. You can have fun here. And if going out and eating out in restaurants is about having fun and excitement and sharing that with your friends, then this ticks a lot of boxes. The food's good. Bloody good. A few areas of tightening up. Service needs to come together. Glamorous, great, attentive individuals, but they need to play as a team. And then when the team's all singing off that hymn sheet, you've got one amazing restaurant. It's good to get constructive criticism. We go back and we sort it out. That's what we get paid for. Sometimes it only hurts the most, but you just get back up again. Exactly. It's more stronger.